a busy day today. Get this. Yeah, he has a museum here in Nashville. Can you guess? And you know him as the man in black. Of course, we are talking Johnny Cash. And now a new movie unveils his hardships and the Cash family's untold story. That's right. To start us off, we want to take a look at the tra trailer. It's a darkness that I that I can't describe. It's a hopelessness. Walk the Line is a sweet Hollywood movie, but that's not the real deal. I think it was really hard for Dad to trust anyone. Being in the Cash family, there's an expectation as not being a letdown. You know, I thought I was tough until I got that phone call. When I realized that my mom was a drug addict, I was four. The police found him with his arm sticking up through the snow. When they slam that steel door behind you and you hear nothing, silence is, is hard. Oh my goodness. Mm. We are joined now by executive producer Jack Vale and Mark Allen Cash, Johnny Cash's nephew. And just watching you guys watch that was really, really interesting. Why tell this story now? Mm -hmm. It never gets old to me. I've seen that trailer over and over and over, and I've seen the movie so many different times, and, and all of the clips and interviews, and it's so gripping. And mm -hmm. I've never heard, of all the documentaries that I've ever seen or films about the man in black, mm -hmm. never seen anything like this before. So it really blew my mind that something came into the picture, that I could learn something new about him, and it's so raw and honest, and mm -hmm. I knew I had to be a part of this project. Oh, it's mm -hmm. amazing. Yeah. Um, Right before we started the show, we were just talking about how um, substance abuse, October, is Substance Abuse Prevention Month, and 45 million people are directly impacted by addiction. What do you hope people take away from this movie? We, you know, we're hoping that, that people understand that this disease of alcoholism and drug addiction affects famous families, non-famous families. Mm -hmm. It doesn't matter who you are. Mm -hmm. Uh, it, it takes no present. It will, it, it, you know, and it, it kills, of course, as yes. you know, and devastates families. Mm -hmm. um, it, it, um, it debilitates the whole family. It, it's not just the person that is addicted, but the folk, anybody that loves them. Mm -hmm. And if we can help one person mm -hmm. overcome or get help or get into recovery, mm -hmm. uh, we've done our job, I think. Yeah. Mm. I've been studying a lot about how certain things are so intergenerational like addiction, mm -hmm. you know, you can trace it back so many generations and at some mm -hmm. point you hope that you stop it somewhere mm -hmm. and hopefully this opens some people's eyes and maybe can make a difference, like you said, if it's just one person. What was it like growing up in the Cash family? Well, you know, um, I get asked that a lot and um, Uncle Johnny was just Uncle Johnny to me, you know. Um, I didn't realize how famous he was at times, you mm -hmm. know, and um, uh, he was a humble, humble man that, uh, uh, loved his family, loved his children, and uh, took good care of his family uh, no matter what, you know? So. Wow, what was it like when you guys watched, for both of you actually, Walk the Line? Well, it, it you know, it's Hollywood. Uh, <laughs> but uh, they, did, they did a good job, especially uh, the singing was incredible. I, I, nobody could have done better, I don't mm -hmm. think. Yeah. yeah. I love looking at all of these old photos of you and your family. What kind of memories do, do those bring up? A lot of good memories. Um, you know, as I mentioned, Uncle Johnny loved his family, and he'd have cookouts and barbecues and things like that, and we'd all gather around. And uh, uh, through the good times and bad times, he was there. Uh, we all were there for him, as, as, uh, of course. But um, uh, yeah, it's amazing the rebirth that he's had. Uh, kids are coming into the museum. They name their kids Cash, you know, and uh, their dogs Cash, wow. and they got sweaters on that say <laughs> Cash. It's just amazing. Yeah. Listen, I named my son. My son's middle name is Cash. Oh, wow. Jackson Cash. <laughs> wow. I was gonna say, what is the the most interesting piece throughout this that you've learned? Because you had mm -hmm. such a such a firsthand view of mm -hmm. everything that is discussed mm -hmm. in this documentary. You know, it was interesting to me to see that not only is it a hard hitting issue, but it was really fun to. Discuss discover that like Mark is an incredibly talented singer, songwriter, musician. And so he sings in the film. Cindy Cash sings in the film. Um, so it was kind of cool to see the talent that kind of runs in the family in addition to some of the 
negative stuff, right? right. So it was kind of neat to see that. I really enjoyed that. Oh, you guys. We're <laughs> very excited to see the full movie. Yeah. Yes, and thank yeah. you so much for being here and sharing thank this you. very, yeah. very important topic thank you with so much. the world. Yes, Absolutely. yes. Absolutely. Sure. Well, you can find out more about this movie at longroadhomemovie.com. It's right there on your screen. Absolutely. It looks amazing.